Hello. Brandon's late. Brandon Tardy. Everyone's here except Stephen Shea. Are you eating a? Is that are you just coming in raw dog meatball? It's not a meatball. I don't know what that is. It looks like a falafel. Might be a meatball. It's a little Greek ball. You just raw dog in it. There's palm in it. What do you want me to do? Well, can I see you throw it up? Mouth? Throw it up in the air and catch it in your mouth, okay. yeah. please. So, see the diet's going well. I do. You want me to? It's fine. <laughs> yeah. I do pick Central at twelve. They announced at eleven fifty-five. There's free Greek fruit food upstairs. Oh, so you're like, what the fuck? So I between shows, it. I just went and grabbed as much as I could and I put it on a plate. How many are in your pockets right now? No, they're all on my desk. Okay. I, oh, you just you hoarded balls. I didn't hoard. I just went and made me a plate, and I'm gonna eat it after the, the yak. Sounds like you hoarded. You do have. You do sound like you have tzatziki sauce in your throat. Mm-hmm. I haven't. I haven't. I, there were Greek. There were potatoes, and I, I threw like three in my mouth, and I was I was full potatoes. Right. Yeah. <laughs> And, and it, 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 you want to go eat? Go eat. No, it was a lot to get it down. No, I'll eat after the show. You're gonna you're gonna have a, a heart attack from potato consumption. No, I eat a lot of potatoes. Yeah, <laughs> no kidding. Right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I ate a lot of potatoes. When your foot was gray in here the other day, did you see all the comments being like, "Serious talk, real quick." My dad had heart disease and his feet were gray. Like a lot of people. Foot's just white. Gray. It was gray that day. It is not. I do not have Prove a it. foot. I got a gray foot. Yeah, that's gray. You you buddy, that's take not. This, take the sock off. <laughs> well, I got a great foot. Serious? Yeah, he really does. You want to look at it? There was like yeah. twenty different Ooh, comments. <laughs> I do too. Oh, my uh, my guy Fieri socks. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's not gray. It's a little no, pink. It's a little that pink. Post gray. <laughs> black on the bottom. It's not black on the bottom at all. Oh, oh, oh. Hey. hey, whoa! Whoa. Oh, Jesus Ew. Christ! Dude, intergalactic. Stinks in here. You won't like him when he's angry. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! No! Oh, no. Oh, wait, this is eats a falafel and he becomes the Hulk. What is this tech? He got so mad at no, it's just Brandon. Misled a falafel wasn't meat. <laughs> <laughs> so what the what? fuck? Chick what? Chick peas? I can't eat a food with chick in it. <laughs> I thought it was Chick Fil A. <laughs> <laughs> on a positive note, though, your hair looks like prime Josh McCown. Well, oh, very much. Yes, uh, on a positive note, it's going from it is McCown. prime. Prime McCown, which I guess You're on your McCown shit. Was late yeah. in his career when he was a high school coach. Yeah. Bears Look, legend. Looking like Macklemore's gay uncle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I see that. Oh, look at you with the John Deere hat. Yeah. I like that. Something else. It's a long brim. It is too long, yeah. There's no such thing as a long, too long brim. No. We should be getting some of those in the Barstool store soon. Hell yeah. Long yes. brim? <laughs> For, uh, it's like a Korean rapper. <laughs> what is, uh, uh, <laughs> what is, uh, what, you know the, the small brimmed hat that you got? Yeah, TJ got me. I've seen I've seen people fashionable people wearing that. Really? I think it's like fashion. Is it? Is that in this season? Well, that's TJ? Brooklyn. Yeah, I put them on. I don't even think it was in Brooklyn. I don't think I saw him in person. I think I saw him via picture. Uh, I, don't know. I don't know where. It wasn't an NBA player. I told Nick today I got another hat for him uh, in the hopper. It's uh, uh, I'm, on yeah, my radar. I love this content of just giving me gifts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because that is Nick's love language. Gift giving. <laughs> no, receiving. Yeah, <laughs> that's my love language. Yeah. It's like one of the love like a gift from you. Receiving gifts. I'm a be- yeah, I'm a better gifts receiver than yeah. giver. I like to get toys. <laughs> that's my love language. It makes me happy. My toxic trait is if I don't like the gift, you'll know. Yeah. <laughs> I will tell you. I will cry. For sure. <laughs> oh, I don't remember asking for this. Did I ever say I wanted this? That's weird. <laughs> Have you guys seen the video of that dude who bought the two Glocks and the BB guns? No. Uh, I saw it on Twitter yesterday. It's hilarious. He shoots someone eating a burger? No, his girlfriend he- comes home and he's like crying on the foot of the steps. And uh, and he's like, I bought two Glocks for 100 bucks." And she's like, why would you ever think you were going to get two Glocks for $100? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and he pulls it out in their BB guns. <laughs> to find that video. Why did he take them though? Like uh, They look real as fuck. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. That might be worth the hundred then, fifty each for real. I was thinking, yeah, that. yeah, yeah. You could still he'll just get shot things. by cops. Right. Yeah, hundred percent. Good to go. TJ, did you see the link I sent you? By the way. Oh yeah. You want to just pop in for a sec? Oh, is he at it again? Day two. Whoa. Thirteen Day million two. people. <laughs> Who's this? Who's this? Partner referred you. That what means they trust play? Grant and Elena Cardone. <laughs> What's his middle name? And most of our partners. Grant and Elena, maybe it was his, his Grant wife. Grant and Elena is, oh. Cardone making an impact on their business. So I want you to thank that partner in the chat for inviting you. And if that partner is a Facebook ad, thank Facebook ads today. <laughs> if that partner was a YouTube ad, thank YouTube ads thank today. Thank you, YouTube ads. That's what thank we're you. talking about today is marketing. 
And so we've got this biggest business event of the year was because of marketing. <laughs> this and guy's not a great speaker. Is marketing. A like of the act today's is a like of marketing. Grant and Elisa Cardone. So I want Cardone. you to thank him yeah. in the comments. Like Who Rima. invited you? And if it's not is a it? person, if it's Elena. like I saw a Grant Cardone video or I saw a Facebook ad, I want you to thank them in the comments. Guys, can we go to the bottom of the comments? I want to be able to see who so they're people thanking. People should be thanking the all act. All the way right. to the bottom right. of the thank comments. Yes. We should yes. see yes. thanking. There's hundreds and hundreds of messages. I don't can think we this get that? set is befitting of uh, Thank you, the act. Look at all, go, all the way. Huge event. Stay, stay towards the bottom. Pace Nunez. Morby. Thank you, thank TJ. You, Let's thank take that. How many minutes thank until you, he actually thank says something about marketing? Thank you, Eric Worre. Thank you, Grant. Ruga. Thank you, him 500. Wait, is he reading the Ooh, chat yeah, right now? Yeah, 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 oh, yes. Let's get him. Yeah, we got to get him to say something. Why am I doing that? Thank you, Terry. Thank you, Shanda. Thank you, Big Bill Allen. Thank you, TikTok. Thank you, Shanda. Thank you, Russell. Thank you, TD Jakes. What if this is the whole thing? Get him, get him. Thank you, Billy Jean. Thank you, Eric and... Like, thank you, Uncle G. Thank you, Anthony Morrison. These are, thank you. Whoa. This is marketing. That's what this day is all about. Now, I want to give you a few this other like, stats. These I stats like this. are amazing they, right Thank here. everyone in your pyramid right scheme. Right spectacular. Yeah, this stats. is marketing. <laughs> Multi-level. Who told you to come here that you could make 10 extra money? I love the name thank Spectacular you. Smith. Uh. Tag everyone in your upline. Spectacular Smith is a great name. Yeah. All right, that should be our goal for the case yep. race. Okay. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> the is called? Can give it is there up. any Come YouTube on, videos house. that have millions of comments? Come on. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. I mean, there's videos that have Mr. millions Beast. of views. Uh, okay, yeah. I want tomorrow on the case race. I want one million comments. <laughs> on the Spam that bitch. Spam it. I don't give a shit yeah. what it says. Is anyone else ner a little nervous? Oh, so for nervous. It? We I was all whole son of a boy dad today is about <sighs> how nervous I am. Dash broke down a strategy. I don't even know if you can tell. Well, no. Don't tell them. What you want to tell your teammates your strategy? Oh, well, I'm gonna hell? compete. Yeah, but I'm you want to tell your teammates your strategy? We should probably talk. Yeah. Well, yeah. no, it's it has nothing to do with the actual race. It's more avoiding it's personal comments. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So you're not gonna talk? Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And if anyone says anything mean to me, I'll agree with them. But you realize that. Your strategy is to not talk, and then you're going to drink eight beers. And then I'm going to talk, yeah. We talked about how after I have two beers, the whole strategy is going to fly. <laughs> you're going to sing like a bird. Yeah, yeah. He does sing nicely when he gets a little... I am excited. I'm very excited. Tomorrow we'll do a one-hour show at 1 o'clock, and then Friday will be the case race, so we're going to tape it tomorrow night. Has anyone talked to Shane? Uh, I texted with him over the weekend. He's, he's still in? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It was Stephen Shane might not be in. Yeah, that's a problem. He got banged out last Someone night. Someone needs to go to his house and pull him out of there. Because you know he just has like a stuffy nose, and he's like, I, I feel like I'm really... Seems like he was he's well enough, a runny ass. Well yeah. enough to work yesterday <laughs> when he had tickets to the Knicks game. Yeah, right. true. I mean, Steven, you should call in and at least give us your pick. Everyone's got to like the, the stream. 2,100 likes. 2,100 yeah. likes, and we'll give out the data pick. Yesterday's boots on the ground parlay hit in the third quarter. Ooh. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah. That, Very that was quickly. a plus 400 parlay. He usually only gives out like a, a flat pick. Yep. The one, dude, oh, yeah. the one week when I, like, aggressively tailed him was last week when he shit the bed. Damn, I went 0-3 <laughs> with Che. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got bed. absolutely bodied by Che, and then every other bet that he makes is literally, yeah, it's, it's, are good bets. They're good bets. No hyperbole. He had a hell of a night. Oh, Steve, he just said, I will be in. He's like a 23-year-old who just got his first job and is, like, drinking before going into work and is realizing that he can get hung over. Like yeah, he's hung over. He's hung over. He's hung over. He's hung over because he had a fun ass night at a yeah at a feet on the wood with Jinx. Look at that. I think it's Stephen, Jinx. call in and and Jinx, and give us the pick. Everyone like the stream. That Jinx? Yeah, he's a cool looking dude. He's a cool looking dude. Super Why cool looking. Dude. Yeah, cool pants. He has to snowboard. Yeah, There's smoke coming out of his head. <laughs> yeah, you're a right. He does. Guy. That's a very hot man. It's like he's getting fucked sideways by a smoke <laughs> dick. <laughs> it's impaled his brain. Do you think they fucked? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think they at least kissed. Yeah. Just a light peck. Gentle touching. Tramped a chicken finger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. For the big game. Heard their hands touched in the popcorn bucket. <laughs> just sat there for a second. Grab the wrong Linger. dick at the trough. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that's not mine. Whoopsies. <laughs> Looked identical. Steven is definitely the number one suspect on this show to like get gifts and somehow end up having to have sex, gay sex. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, we were, <laughs> my feet were on the wood. He said I could go anytime I wanted. <laughs> He's on his feet on my Steven. Hey, what's up? You're sick? 
Uh, yeah, I have just like a little congestion, so I want to kind of <laughs> with that before I come back tomorrow. I was sick on Monday. I came in. I don't think being congested yeah, I mean, I, is sick. Yeah, no. You sound fine. No, I'm congested today. I'm always I, a little. I literally bit... just blew my nose before I got on the phone. But yeah, I mean, I'm not 100. percent I'm probably 65, percent and ideally tomorrow I'll be in the 80s. What is okay? So what is 50 percent if congestion is 65 yeah. percent? <laughs> That's like taking, like I have a winter hat on right now and I'm inside. Also, anything over 50% oh, case closed. Here in a winter <laughs> hat. On. 0% dead. I mean, I, I know I know where the money's made, and tomorrow it's going to be a huge show. So I want to be at my desk for that. He's, a, he's an earner. I want to drag smart, myself man. into work. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I did my I did the bracket yesterday, and I was in the phone coffin for a decent portion of it. And I also think that's inconsiderate if people come in and do that. Huh. How was your date? Uh, it was awesome. Uh, Nick Swan, boots on the ground parlay hit. And, uh, yeah, it was a good time. We were second row behind the baseline. Um, really cool. I've, I've never been that close. And, uh, yeah, Jake was a fun, was a fun dude. And uh, we went to dinner beforehand and then went to the game. It was a good time. Oh, you went wow. to dinner today. Wow. Wow. Beautiful. Was it a nice you dinner? dinner? Uh, it was, like, across the street at, you know, whatever that place is. Oh, uh, that place. Like yeah. an Irish bar. Did you pay? I was going to, and then he actually snatched it. So, oh, oh. interesting. You're his little kitten. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, bought, I, bought, I, bought, I bought drinks when we were in the game. All right, so, Stephen, do you have your pick for tonight? I do. Everyone like the stream. Do we, we do enough likes? Yeah, let me know when. What are we going, 2,100 today? We need 2,100, yeah. We're at 850. Oh, come on, guys. Yeah, I like the stream. Oh, Let's go. Just I'm get the pick like for the free. Stream. Yeah. If, if there's any incentive, the the odds are moving a lot. I put in the play 10 minutes ago, and the odds have changed uh, a bit since then. Have you so announced the play? Those likes up sooner I, can. I haven't, no. I'm going to announce it here exclusively. Well, this isn't a play for anybody but you. What do you mean? No, it's for everybody. Everybody else is going to get a, a lesser Pretty version of odds. it. Though. Well, I mean, I'm trying to help the show. All right, so maybe just call back later. Okay. Yeah, let me know. Let me know when we get to that, and I'll dial back in and do the pick. Did you right. Did you feel the sickness coming on last night at all? Yeah, I felt it yesterday, um, but you know, powered through it. I had I did the bracket and then had the had the game, so um, I was okay at that. Like if I went in today, I'd be okay, but I just know I wouldn't be at close to eighty percent tomorrow. So that's the focus: the case race, the cake race. That's what I'm focused on. Okay. Sure. What right. if you're at 79 percent tomorrow? Do you yeah. think you'll still come in? I'm worried about that too. I mean, I'm coming in no matter what percentage I am at tomorrow. So okay. oh, you're gonna get us all sick. Uh, okay. All right. Nice. Very selfish of you. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm in a no-win situation. What do you guys want me to do? I want you to be better. Yeah, I want that too. I, I bought a lot of uh, um, uh, remedies today at CVS. Okay. All right. So call back in when you see 2100. All right. Okay. Can right. I tell you one thing? What? I, I, I legitimately fell and yelled in my room today. Um, I, was, I was sitting down. I was actually watching the PMT Stephen A. Smith interview, and I went up to go get something, and I didn't realize my feet had been up on like an ottoman for about 40 minutes. My left leg was completely asleep, and I stood up, and my leg completely gave out. I yelled as I fell over, and I'm okay, but it was a humbling moment. What kind of yell? What did it sound like? Uh... It wasn't quite quite like you with the bug, but it was like it wasn't a shriek, but it was a yell like I had just been hit with something very hard. Like ah, a... ah, Ooh. ah, Ooh. yeah. All right, ah. all right. Ah. All right so, ah. so Steven, watch the stream and, and just call back in, okay? Okay, you got it. All right. Okay, bye. Right, so, bye. so um, I thought it would be more appropriate. We, we know Steven. I wanted to hear from the other side of the date. So Jenks is calling in right now. Perfect. You got Jenks. So we can interview him. We can do an exit Holy interview. On. He already gave me one anecdote, and it is full on Stephen Shea. Um, but I'll let him tell. Yeah. Him. Yeah. It's good. This, oh, classic Stephen Shea. So he should be calling in right now. He's it. He's on. Jenks. What's up, guys? What's up? Oh. So I loved, want- I loved hearing the debate on how to pronounce my name yesterday. Yeah, Brandon butchered it. It's close. Yeah, he's very lost. 
Jenks. So, Jenks, we wanted to talk to you about how Steven was on the date. Um, will there be a second date? That kind of stuff. But why don't you start with the anecdote you already told me, and then we can go from there. Yeah, totally. So I think for me, the most surprising thing was how easily I managed to put some bait out there and get Steven to just agree to meet with a total stranger. Mm -hmm. It was almost frightening how easy it was. So I show up, he brings me into the office and he gave me like a cool little laugh around, but he was very quiet and kind of nervous. I figured he was probably getting me on camera in case I was going to like kidnap him or something. And then like he said, we went, we had a beautiful dinner, just chicken wings, drinks he seemed very healthy like he was pretty much at 110 percent. he was really oh, nice wow and, uh, i'll never forget for the rest of my life i looked at him and i said shay you know you can tell i'm a normal guy now and like everything's cool but were you not concerned at all that like i could have a van out front and i'm gonna like take you and he looked me dead in the eye and said i could take you <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a perfect <laughs> And I was like, honestly, man, I've never done this before, but if you're going to get kidnapped, it's probably not just a one-on-one -on -one fight in the bar. Like, I would have had it planned out a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, just look out for Shay, man. I, like, I, he, he doesn't just trust the numbers. He trusts people. Yeah. That yeah. Oh, that's bad. Takeaway. He's not a robot. So, I just liked that he fit, he he had he had done a ocular pat-down of you and been like, I can, I can your fuck ass. this guy up. And uh, like the other thing is, I was wearing kind of baggy clothes, and I really don't think he could take me. So like, he, I think he was really off on all of it, which is <laughs> again kind of scary for him. Yeah, you need to see your physique. What were you gonna say, Ron? Uh, it's just that he sees uh, like the to him the the uh, the data or like uh, the the stats are him, which is like a person. Like he sees data as human beings. Like he trusts the data. He trusts human yeah. beings because he sees them as one and the same thing. If a crosswalk turned green, Shay would walk into traffic without thinking twice. Yeah. Wow. You got, you got, you know him well. Yeah. Oh, oh you're, he would have looked oh, at his ass. Oh, you would have so fucked him up. Put him up to his ass. I've been on a date that good in three, four years, honestly. Great okay. date. All right, so what else about Shay? What else, uh, any mannerisms or weird shit? Oh. Dude, you're a beast. Oh. We're looking at your Twitter pictures right now. You, you, you're you jacked. And that guy's in long sleeves and you're in a tank. Yeah. I appreciate that. Appreciate that. Um, so for Shay, I think as a date, he needs to be on his phone a little bit less. Like, I get, you know, you got to tweet, you got to do some content. Yeah. But he didn't get that much content during the game to justify being on the phone so much. I also told him that I'm, I'm lucky enough to be buddies with Alan Houston and he was going to come over at halftime and say hello, which he did. And then Shay promptly went to the bathroom right before he came over. Wow. So kind of rude, a little bit weird. Kind of <laughs> this, is a, this is a perfect <laughs> breakdown. He's <laughs> not mincing words. Um, he also, he also was, he was very, very like fun, very cool. But my whole thing at Knicks games is if you're in the first two rows as a fan, you have a civic responsibility to affect the game positively for the Knicks. And a lot of fans think that, like, shit-talking players is going to help, and it normally doesn't, especially the good players. So instead, what you need to do is research the referees and throughout the game just compliment them just constantly throughout the game. And all of a sudden, the Knicks start getting more calls. So last night, my big target was Bill Kennedy, 25-year NBA ref, favorite music, Luther Vandross. Uh -huh. Stood up during an early free throw, screamed that at him. And like he looked right at me, big smile. Shay, I think, was super uncomfortable, but he played pretty cool. So like that was a good date moment where like, you know, I took him out of his comfort zone, but he came with me. Thanks. Can I ask where you're from? You kind of have a yeah. cool Wayne's World accent. Are you Canadian? Or are you Scandinavian? Are you, yeah. Where are you from? I'm from New York, but I'm definitely a weirdo. Like I've lived in Belgium. I've lived in Italy. I've lived in California. Oh, yes. I've got friends that are rough around the edges i got corporate friends so i'm a little bit of a chameleon i love it so how did the date end were you guys was there a hug a handshake is there going to be a second date i mean well first of all i i offered you know a second date and i'd take anybody on the yak on a second date you know too i heard b walk wanted to get in and you know i slid into his dms last night so i think welcome as well i think jenks should just take we all we all have to go on one we have to go on one day get critiques by him yeah 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 afterwards yeah I'm a good date. I promise. I'm a good date. I'm attentive. You know, you guys will let me know what your flow is, and then we'll rock it out. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, so at the end, it was, it was definitely a moment of, of you know, what are we going to do? Are we going to hug? 
Are we going to handshake, you know, maybe a little knock bump, maybe a kiss? Like, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure where it was going to go. And if I knew he was sick, I probably wouldn't have done this, but we, we bear hugged. It was, it was really wow. nice. Was oh, wow. Nice. A lot of energy between us, kind of like sparks everywhere kind of situation. So not even a handshake hug, just a full-ass hug? Bear hug. to dick? Bear hug, be walk A bear hug. Wow. It wasn't the handshake into hug. We just grabbed each other like long-lost loves. It was That's... beautiful. Do you think when you, when, you were, when you were in the embrace of Stephen Che, do you think that he might have been right that he could have taken you? Did you feel his strength? <laughs> no. I, I felt very safe. Like, I was definitely the alpha. <laughs> yeah, he's taller than me, but I feel like... If I bear hugged him and squeezed as hard as I could, I could break his back. <laughs> Which I would never want to do. No, no, no. He's no. a man. No. Um, okay, okay, okay. okay, so any other thoughts on Che? I mean, this is a great recap of his date. Something that maybe we wouldn't know. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. I think one thing I'll honestly say is you guys would probably be, like, disgusted by how nicely he speaks of all of you. He actually loves all you guys. Oh, I was oh, worried that was the case. Super authentic. Yeah, no, it's gross. It's gross. But, he, like, I couldn't get anything negative. Um, the other one is he really cares about his text. So I was, I was very impressed with that. And, you know, Big Cat, I do want to apologize. I've sent you... 66 NBA picks over the last 66 days, and I'm yeah. 26 and 40. Yeah. So like, to me, the one Stop. thing I'm doing for you there is anytime you're down and you're in a real cold streak, just always know I exist, and I'm much worse than you. Yeah, you, you're you, never the worst. You did the worst kind of giving picks, too, where the first one you gave was such an like easy winner that I was like, this guy is sharp, and then I rode for, I don't know, like 10 picks, and it was bad. Yeah, you can send me the invoice on that. That's like totally on me. That's my fault. <laughs> That's all right. It's gambling. I always, whenever someone sends me a pick, listen, I'm the one who has to put it in. So it's, I'm a big boy. My system is the exact opposite of Shay. I do no analysis. When I'm doing my morning poop, I pit, pull up the, the spreads and I send you my pick. Yeah. All right. And well, you know, I, I hold myself accountable. I always give you my record first. That's a fact. That's a fact. Terrible. All right, well, Jenks, thank you for calling in. I think we got to set this up. I think Brandon, you got to go next. I'm going next. If you think Jenks, if you thought that Che was on his phone a lot, Brandon is going to not oh, talk to you yeah. the entire time. I talk. I'm a very good date. Brandon will be the worst by far. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm a good date. You cool. wouldn't even acknowledge him. No, I've I've already been talking You're to him. Held accountable. I've been doing groundwork with him. I'm good. I'm ready. Oh, you've been talking to Jenks since yesterday. <laughs> you already. I told Jay, when you go, if this guy's cool, I want to go next. I told Jay. <laughs> all right, so, Jenks, I give you permission to yeah, kidnap I met, Brandon. I met you guys all in person in L.A. when you guys were doing the Super Bowl week. I was in the same hotel you guys were in. Oh. And I actually sat down and had a drink with you guys, but I weirded out Big Cat big time because I wasn't sure what to do when I first met him, but I wanted him to, like, remember me. So I took a knee to yell, like, you know, the King of the North, like Game of Thrones for some I don't know why. I remember this. <laughs> yeah, you would, yeah. I was like, I was like a random dude for oh. you, and you got so weirded out. I yeah. Yeah. It. Yeah, you, yeah. that was a weird move, Sorry, dude. That. Yeah. No, it's a power weird move. move. <laughs> it's the opposite of it. I appreciate mode. it, though. But hey, you're you're now part of the Yak Lore, and, and Brandon's next up. And, and I, I'll say this. If you, if you go... Brandon, and then maybe two more, and no one gets kidnapped. I I'm ready for my date with Jenks. Consider it done. Okay. Yeah, All right. Don't fuck me over. It's, it's done. All right. Love it. All right. Thank you, Jenks. Appreciate the call. Thank you, guys. All right. Uh, one more. One more. One more. Uh, what do you do for a living? You guess. God. <laughs> Finance. Um, is it legal? Come on. Rowing instructor. It's a cocaine legal? dealer. I think people legal have personalities like this? Oh, <laughs> what does he do? Sales. Does it involve money? There you go. Real estate. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sales. Yeah. sales. Yeah, sales. You're a sailor. I get to run a, a really great um, growth department at a company called Bequip and just manage like really awesome people that work their asses off and you know make it really fun because sales is tough. Got to be. Got to be tough, not for the faint of heart. I love it. I like Jenks. Yeah. Dude. All right, well, Jenks, thank you. We'll, we'll be in touch. We'll, we'll see when Brandon goes, and then we'll go from there. All right, guys. Be good. Good luck on the, the case race tomorrow. All right, thank you, Jenks. Thanks. I'm not, I like Jenks. I, I guess. Too. I'm not rolling out kidnapping, though.
I, well, if he kidnaps I'm, you, I think it's fair but, play. But who's the target? He now knows he can get to the target if he just has two or three or four good dates. Yeah, that's maybe, maybe, maybe the we'll, target's maybe wrong. We'll that is a, that's a, a good twist. strategy uh, for kidnapping. You know, the first one yeah. goes perfectly. You know, set a base. Might have to say you know what we do is we'll, going. Yeah, I'll say I'm going, and then we'll have Sass go. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Then that way, if there's like a van out front, we know. Uh. What if Sass is the target? That'd be fine. Well, he wouldn't. He wouldn't kidnap me. Well, if he did, that'd be. And also, he wouldn't be prepared. It'd be the easiest to kidnap. I was target. Me and Big Cat will switch, so he'll never know. Oh, Che's back with the pick. Che has to come back at him because he said some some things. No, I think he said all facts. Well, Che, why was you? Why were you on the phone so much? Che, are you guys there? Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Um. No, uh, I mean, I, I think I was on the phone. My phone and <laughs> over here, I wasn't playing a very good game, and that was my pick yesterday. So. Yeah, it's certainly following that. And then once the parlay hit, then I had to get all my stuff out there. Um, so I probably missed like three minutes of game action. But overall, I thought I was pretty um, fine. I, I would check my phone certainly for the game. Also, well, you missed Allen Houston. You missed well. Allen Houston. What happened there? Yeah, so I mean, I had to go pee. And he was like, oh, Allen's going to come over. And then he was like, oh, I think he might be at the buffet or something like that. So I was like, all right, I'm just going to go pee. I'll be right back. But then the line was really long. And um it was uh you know he he's friends with alex Houston. it would have been cool to meet alan houston but at the same time like gotta you know, pee. i'm i'm yeah i mean i gotta pee so um I, that's not that in the world i didn't go i didn't go to meet alan houston i went to have a have an awesome next game which jenks uh, provided yeah I, i'll say just the little i know of jenks from that phone call i like him more than you yeah no he's a good dude I want to clear things up. We didn't. We didn't do a full bear hug. We did a, a bro hug. It was. It was oh, you nice call him a liar. Parting, but. Wait, was it one arm or two arms? Uh, I mean, the right. Both of our right arms slapped, and then you know, a big like grip with the left. So bear. What's, a, a, that, what's a bear hug versus a bro hug? Can I? I, I? A bro is. I kind of just do one arm. I actually. Yeah, bear yeah hug let me is see. Like two arms all the way around the. Person. Bear hug is like. Bro hug is handshake, but hug. Brandon. Yeah. yeah. What's this first one? The bro hug. Oh, the okay, side. That, yeah, yeah, one, yeah. Okay, and the butts stick out so that's, that's, your dick. There's <laughs> <laughs> some coward. <laughs> Little baby. Huh. Yeah, but I, I won't deny any of the, like, yeah, I was on my phone. I was checking the Tyler Hero stuff. I got to do it for the people. I would have loved to pick a Knicks or Cavs player, but, you know, the data didn't point to that as the best pick, so I didn't do that. But the parlay hit. So, yeah, I had to get that out there. I'm always working. And also, shout out Michelangelo. He was like six rows behind us for some reason, but um, he was there as well. Yeah. So shout out. Yeah. Um, I, so uh, a lot of people in the comments are clamoring for uh, for the pick. So I'll yeah, let's do it. Do the pick. Pick tonight is Hawks guard Deontay Murray under six and a half assists. I very rarely do an under. Trey Young's going back to Oklahoma. Um, he went to college there. Uh, they played like a month ago. Deontay Murray had three assists. Trey Young's going to handle the ball a lot tonight. He's going to be the focus. Um, so I think he could have a nice game. Uh, but I like Murray to be under six and a half assists. He's also done this only one time in his last 15 road games. Um, so data's pretty strong. He's m- way fewer um, assists on the road. So um, I like this play. Okay. Thank you, Steven. See you tomorrow. I'll tweet it out more. Um, yes, I'll see you guys tomorrow. And, yeah, that, that was accurate. And, yeah, he, he pretty much was like, how come – are you sure I'm not when you when he was phrasing up the question, how do you know I'm not a kidnapper? I did I was like, What the fuck is wrong with this dude? But then uh yeah, I mean he's he's definitely in good shape and he's a strong dude, but I don't know. You, I, would you beat him in physical so combat? Uh he would probably beat me, but it wouldn't be an easy one. Like I'm a lot bigger than him. So uh as taller? far as math, he's definitely stronger than him. Yeah, I'm a lot taller than him. He's probably like five ten, five eleven. What kind of I nice mean, stuff not, were you saying about us, though? Easily. Well, you're like 6'2". I don't think you're a lot taller than he is. 6'2 uh, and 3 quarters. My bad. Uh, what what were uh, what were you saying about all of us? He said that you were like super nice about all of us. Yeah, so I don't know if you guys remember this. So we met him before. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah he brought that up. Um, Wait, why was he at our hotel? Okay. Yeah, that, that might be no, a red flag. Do you guys remember? <laughs> it was... It was like the last night we were all there, and it was it was right after the last yak, and we were sitting at a. Um, this is when it clicked for me. We we're sitting at. A yeah, table I remember this and very that. well. Yes, and he was with a girl, and we were like, "Whoa, who's this guy?" Oh, so yeah. And he made a comment, and he bought us all drinks. I think he was that super was drunk. Yeah, I remember uh, him. Yeah, he was hammered. Well, that explains the one knee. Yeah. yeah. The north. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
So I was just, you know, he was just like, yeah, I wonder if these people are really nice. And I was just saying, yeah, everyone's really nice and, and all that. So, um, yeah, I think Brandon is uh, rightfully up next, and I'd be happy if all you guys went to a next team with this guy. We're going to do it. Yep. We're on the gauntlet. Okay, great. See how it goes. Great. All right. Thank you, Stephen. Love it. Love it. Right, thanks. Love it. Love it, brother. Bye. Yeah, it goes on a date. It's, I mean, it's a great uh, science test. I don't think the date's going to get to you. I think so. I want to make him fall in love with me. <laughs> uh, that, but it's always the Knicks game? Or, like, can we... I'm, I'm going to wait out for playoffs. <laughs> so, Big Cat, you're the final boss here? Yeah. Huh. So who's after you, Brandon? I don't know. Who's up? Who wants it? I want him to take me to the MoMA. Uh-huh. <laughs> I want to go somewhere nice. Let's go to the <laughs> Philharmonic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I'd like to just putt putt with him. Yeah, just something simple. I don't get the sense he has the tickets every game. I, he said he has to ask for them. So he told me to pick out a few games in February that I I, I would circle. Like what? What are, you, what are we looking at? Not a great slate in February for the Knicks. No. I play the Lakers Thursday. Uh, yeah, they're about to thirty first. But uh, are you going to that? What's that Monday? Tuesday, I think. Tuesday, maybe. I think it's Tuesday. Is Pat going to be in studio? Um. No, because I have to go to Arizona this weekend for a gambling competition when he's in town. <laughs> Drats. Oh, That's damn poor it. planning. Drats, yeah. And also the Eagles are in the NFC Championship. Right. Yeah, all all ev- all the stars are. What's the opposite of aligning? <laughs> They're de-aligning. They're de-aligning. It's a black, black hole. hole. <laughs> yeah, it's a black. Falling hole. into a black hole. It's bad news, but he's going to go on out and about instead. Oh, that's good. Oh, we fired. He like that. Yeah, the ins and outs of basketball. He didn't like you uh, making fun of the autistic rapper. No. Yeah. That was pretty funny. I know. <laughs> I don't think he understands how I did it, though. I was, like, uh, tactful in my make f- making fun of. I wasn't just, uh, you know, blanket statement, basic insults, making fun of him. Tyler Miller tweeted the clip, and what a 180 that Pat did. Yeah, he was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> did LeBron have 47 last night? Yep. Yeah, I saw some of the highlights. It was making me laugh. He's so good. Yeah, but all the highlights were like LeBron for three, and they're down twenty-five. Yeah, but he's—I mean—he's so good at basket. It's insane how he's getting better at basketball. It's a hot hate take. Him. This is a hot take right now. Average thirty-nine and eight makes it hard to hate him. Nah, makes it kind of hard to hate him. He's so good. He already and he's also so got old. mad at the fan. What the fans are assholes and idiots. Unk vibes. <laughs> yeah, fuck with Unk though. <laughs> I think Pat Bev was wearing the same uh, sweatshirt as Unk or uh, sweater as Unk oh. in that last interview, which is like a three thousand dollars sweater. Maybe too yeah. much to pay for a sweater. Nah, statement piece. Yeah, I don't know. What's the most expensive clothing that you guys all have? What piece of one cloth? Cloth. Like thirty five dollars. I was gonna say I don't even have. I think it's just a pair of shoes. Yeah. What's the yeah. most expensive one? I think the off-white Jordans are like a thousand, okay. and that's everything else is. I mean, I'm wearing forty-five dollars shoes now, so I'll hardly get you tungsten. Yeah. <laughs> that won't get you. <laughs> I have a hat that's like a hundred fifty dollars. Really? The yeah, my you? Hat, mine's the hat I'm wearing right now. Wait, let me see, TJ. Where'd you get it? Like a vintage store? Like yeah. a? Mine's a Tilly. I don't wear any Tilly. I've got a Tilly. Yeah. I was wearing a Montclair beanie in here that was three ninety nine. <laughs> I got it from Chinatown for nineteen dollars. Oh hell yeah! So it's fake. Oh yeah. It's <laughs> the most expensive piece of clothing you own. Rones is definitely a lot. You have yeah. a suit. I have a suit. I have suits that are, I have like expensive, a twelve hundred dollars yeah. suit. Yeah, that's probably the most expensive. Yeah. Suits well, are mine like are bridesmaid dresses. That yeah, bridesmaid dresses. You wear once and then never again. I don't even have a suit. Those I'm pants you guys made fun of that you thought were for D and D. That's probably my most expensive. Really? How much? It was like two fifty from oh, Nordstrom. Oh no. I know the Grail God over here is being a little yeah, bit yeah, quiet. Being, <laughs> <laughs> this dude's got pieces. Yeah. What you got? Your most expensive. What's the best one? Um, I think I got a, f- a 1500 crew. What? Maybe a little less, maybe a c- 1500 crew? What maybe does that mean? a little less. A crew maybe crew neck 1492. Is that a t-shirt? Columbus on my shirt. Oh shit. <laughs> t-shirt, Dang. not the crew Columbus. neck. <laughs> mm-hmm. the That's crew. crazy. Oh. Have and we've seen it probably. Ah, uh, yeah. Is it the Tasmanian Devil one? Also, that <laughs> it's the one with the nah, twin towers. That, that's a light too, but <laughs> <laughs> uh, fucking that Olympic one that I copped. Right, Mac Miller. Wait, should, Mac Miller had the same wait, one. the one you yeah. took from my pile? No way. 
No, the one that's like all the, it's a crew neck. Where did it's I all get like that? The that was from Big Said, I saw the clip, and by the way, I I am very much. They were giving you shit. It was under the pile for probably ten months. I'm 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 backing you up. My me pile Sue cup. Pile. What's how is that different than going to a thrift store? Yeah. and finding it. <laughs> no, and yeah. Brandon. It's comes, all about the eye. Oh, Brandon comes and takes shit off my pile all the time. I don't it's all care. About the eye for the threads. Yeah. If, if anyone wants to take stuff from my pile, they're more than welcome. That's what it's there for. Take cash off his desk. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just come on over. I throw stuff on the pile. Yeah, that's the thing. Is other people up. throw stuff on there. It's like, it's community. Piles for everyone. Yeah, I sneak stuff in it. Don't feel shame. Man, that is a sick sweatshirt, though. It is sick. It is. I didn't know it was for my pile. That really tells you how deep it is. There are gems in there. Yeah. Oh, there's mm-hmm. there's crazy things in the pile. What's the expensive crew neck? I'm trying. I'm racking my brain of your fits. Where'd you get it? <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> I'm trying to think if I wore it. I got it um, from a website. Oh, shit. Ooh. An online thrift. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that ain't no, I don't sweet. even know how I ended up having that. You look good in it. I would not. Thank you. Thank you. The fact. I wonder what Rudy's is. Oh, Rudy's. Oh. NK. Crazy fits. He's wearing like the Frank Ocean necklace. Yeah. That's like two grand. Yeah. Moron. <laughs> Idiot. I gotta get new shoes. Maybe I'll drop some, drop a hundred on some shoes. Oh shit, says. Shit. Want to get some Air Monarchs? Forty-five bucks. I got a new colorway that just came in. I might have to actually. Look at the soles of my shoes. Oh, what are you doing, dude? Good. Yeah. Oh, Whoa. That's not comfy. No. It actually isn't bad at all. <laughs> yeah, it is. No, I will say, I will say my one socks. one chance we're letting you complain. My <laughs> socks keep on. <laughs> my socks keep ripping, which is annoying. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because you just have your feet on barbed wire. I think the I think this one might be worse. Are the are the shoes like, oh, yeah, this just, one's way worse? Come oh. on, Sass. Oh, buddy. This guy has mice? <laughs> what? What are you doing, Sass? I wonder the hobos attack. I just don't like getting new shoes because I always get blisters. Oh. So I, you Get know, I'll wear them it. until they, and also I wear them until they rip. Like, like any other pair of shoes I have, I, they usually rip on the sides. Why don't you get well-made shoes then, or something? Like some well, these haven't way. ripped. I mean, they're fucking crumbling. They're just these are in perfect condition. <laughs> <laughs> I had someone. I was on stage a couple weeks ago, and some dude was like, "Your shoes look like they went through the Civil War." <laughs> And I didn't have word. anything to say. I was like, "Yeah, you're right." I don't think that those are those fought for the South. They fought for the. Ah, <laughs> oh, never mind. I make a joke there. <laughs> And then he left because I made a joke about COVID. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. They got pissed. They were it like, it's, it's not joke. real. They were like, it's not real. Oh. I didn't even, it was, the joke wasn't even about COVID. I was just telling a story about when I had COVID. And they were like, COVID's not, it's not like a real thing. And then, and then they laughed at the joke. Actually, no, so they didn't leave on that. They laughed at the joke. And then I, made, and then I said something about monkeypox. And that's when they left. Ah. <laughs> that was too much for them to handle. One, two, yeah. yeah. Uh. This was in Bridgeport, Connecticut, so. <laughs> Damn. Let's uh let's get some new shoes though, Sass. Yeah, let's yeah. get I have I have a brand new pair of Converse. What size like shoe do you wear? You don't know? Well, because ch- I change it a lot. Sass is Angels. It's, it's, it's time to get in formation and send him some it's time to gift These Sass some shoes to the Barstool office. Send him some nines. No, I have a send brand new a, pair of Converse send him a I just bunch have to start of wearing. Nines. Yeah. Just gotta break them in. Sassy's Angels, you know what to do. I got my uh my LL Bean hiking boots. Throw those on. You're good. Yeah. I'm a minimalist. Yeah. No. <laughs> Are you? I mean, in a no, way, no, I don't not. have anything. No, you're not. The only thing I, the only thing that I want more of is crew necks. That's the only thing I ever want more of. I got what do you. You spend money on. Uh. Beer and pool. I guess. Yeah. Hotel rooms. Video games. Rat traps. Rat traps, probably. Yeah. Yeah, that's your biggest. The only video game I play is free. Warzone's a free game. So where does all your money go? Warzone's free. Yeah. I didn't know that. I mean, but the like the whole game is you have to pay for it, but you can buy just that. You can get just the Warzone. Oh, okay. That's what I did. And you want to do the high noon ad? Why do you have the meatball just sitting directly on the? Yeah. Not a I haven't meatball. even eaten it. Is it falafel? It's not good. Yeah. Throw me that falafel. I knew you wouldn't like it. I don't like it. Falafel? I like falafel. I love uh, it. That was a bad throw by me. Oh, Ron. <laughs> it's a little, it's going to take you a lot of chews. You got to have the falafel. dipping sauce nice. with it. I think it's nice. It's going to take you a lot of chews. Um, are you not going to zone out, are you? 
I'm just gonna. You good? Where's the the act sheet? Wait, what was why? Why would Big Head zone out? <laughs> Can you pick that up? Is this gonna be out of the? What week? up? The papers. Why? Because then I have to pick them up. I'll get them. I'll get them. I'll get them in a minute. Uh, high noon. Presenting the yak today. High noon is a hard seltzer made with real vodka, real juice, and sparkling water. It's actually made with vodka and not with malt like other hard seltzers, Roan. You still aren't able to talk because you're still chewing. I hate malt, and I think malt is terrible, and I think anyone that drinks malt is probably a bad person. Uh, High Noon has real juice and real vodka for real people just like us. Head over to your local liquor store and get some today. They have some of the best flavors in the game, like your peach, your watermelon. The new flavors last fall were uh, pear and cranberry. I hear coming down the pipe. We have kiwi. Might have. So we have kiwi, passion fruit. Passion fruit. Guava. Guava. Black cherry. Black oh. cherry. All the Black cherry was one of the originals. Yes, it was one of the uh, the originals. Yes, exactly yes. what you just said. You said one it was one of the originals. <laughs> yes, it was. You said it was one of the new flavors. I didn't mean to say that. No, you I did. said it was one of the good flavors. No, you said there was the new flavors that came out last year, and then you put black cherry in the list. Which I didn't confused me. No, no, I said confused me because actually the first the time two new had flavors had were pear and cranberry, and then I said all the other great flavors. Oh, then we said mm. kiwi, guava. Uh huh. And then you said black cherry, which threw me off. The black cherry is delicious. You would agree. It is delicious, but it's definitely it's not the new. Even though it's not new, it's still a delicious flavor. It is. So kiwi was a new flavor last year. So it was guava and the passion fruit. Yes. And of course, the watermelon was new, actually, I believe, too. No, no, no. Watermelon's an OG, too. No, watermelon hasn't been around forever. Watermelon's been around longer than all the other ones. It's not true at all. Watermelon's black a, cherry, I think. Watermelon's I'm not, bla- maybe not original. Black cherry. Watermelon for high noon's been around a long time. It's going to win awards. This ad is going to win awards. Watermelon's I don't know about that. I don't know about that. You the watermelon that. is good? Watermelon's my favorite one. That's why I know it's not one of the Well, others. I like the peach. That's what I like. I like okay. the peach. High noon. Check it out at your local liquor store today. It's delicious. Big Bad cat. boys. Good job. Did you zone? Did you? Oh, I, no, I was listening to the whole thing. You guys were talking about watermelon? Okay. Tolerant? I think watermelon was probably a, an original flavor. Mm. I, actually, I want to say it was pineapple, black cherry. Grapefruit. Grapefruit, and maybe peach. No, peach was. Peach a wasn't. Flavor. I think minty menthol was one of the first. I think watermelon was. Uh, uh, watermelon wasn't. Minty, minty menthol, I think, was up there. Mm. Phone charger in here or no? Chamomile. There might be one. There's usually one by Sass behind. There isn't today. My phone. I stole that. Damn it, KB. (laughs) (laughs) I fucked around and got a dog last night. What? I'm sorry. What? What? Yes. Yeah, puppy. I got a dog yesterday. Wait, what? Do you have pictures? Little close to my birthday. (laughs) (laughs) And when's your birthday? Monday. Tomorrow. Uh. Yes. Fuck, dude! I didn't mean nothing by it. Yeah, you're good. What? What? Is it a pure you got brand? a dog? Yeah, a I rescue? got a, a rescue from uh, it's for, it was from the um, Texas Mexico border and came up to Connecticut and we got approved and uh, rode up and adopted it last night. It's a little. Time. Shut up! Is it your house right now? Yeah. Can I see a picture. Send it to TJ. Let's yeah, see. We'd like to see. Dog. What's, What's the dog's name? name? Uh, Jalen. I think Penny. It's a girl. Penny's a good. Aww. Oh, that's a dog. Dog name. Dog name. Yeah. It's a girl. Yeah. She's tiny. Look at you. Yeah, dude, I got a fucking dog. I'm pretty fired up about it. That's awesome. Damn. Any advice? I've never had a dog before. Oh, oh, is, a it dog? Like, is it a big yeah. dog, a little dog, a little? Pretty, pretty Don't let tiny. it die. Pretty yeah. tiny. You got to love that thing to death. Yeah, don't man. ask Brandon. Promise me you'll love Snuggles it. Snuggles for days. <laughs> Doesn't look. Dude, it's pretty big. What are you talking about? It says uh, not a tiny dog. It's how old is it? It's uh, two months old. You what, can tell by its paws. What type of dog? What breed? It's a uh, mutt, but it's love it. Uh, it's a uh, credit to you for it's like adopting. It's a it's a mix of like herding dogs. It's always trying to herd. It's always trying to get behind you. You've only known it for like eight hours. How do you know it's always trying to herd? Every right. time, I mean, I'm trying to potty train, so I take it outside like every fucking. Mm. I mean, if it doesn't pee every fifty roast minutes, beef every two hours after that, what potty train? Really? Yeah. When I was potty training Stella, it was if you get like a meat. That is just you. They're not going to eat normally, so it's a very big treat. And the minute they start peeing outside, you just shove it in their mouth. Oh yeah. You get this when you pee. Yeah, that's what I was trying. I was trying yeah, to give them some. Yeah, got to be something very different. Positive. My dog though started faking peeing then to get treats. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. I don't. Had you guys? Did you guys crate train your dogs? Uh oh! Look at that. Oh. That's gonna be oh. that dog's gonna be decent size. The paws are are pretty big. 
on it. It's pretty tiny right now. Yeah, but it's two months. She's so cute. It's pulling up on me like a fucking electric vehicle too. It's fucking silent, and so it just keeps on fucking <laughs> riding up behind me. Um, we crate trained, tried, and then it's just Take. it all depends on whether your dog is like a chewer. Yeah. Like Stella never ate shoes or anything, so then we just let her. She just hangs out. Yeah, this one, I don't know. I can't tell if it's going to be a chewer, but I want to, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the right it's, things to do are when you have a dog. I don't know. It's it's good to create, try to create train. Yeah. Yeah. Try it. Yeah. You, I mean, because especially if you're like going out like on a Saturday night, it's like you don't want to, exactly. until you trust yeah, it. it. It's, and it's a puppy still, you know. If you ever go out of town, I can keep it for you. Oh, I already signed up for that. Mm. That's actually, and he wants to keep it alive, all right? He's not trying to add it to his fucking barn wall with the fucking rest of the pelts that you have up there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Look at you. You're going to be a dog park person? I have a barn. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I guess I guess I am going to be a dog park person. I don't know. I am terrified of killing it, too, though, Brandon. I empathize with you. It'll, it'll happen quick. The well, only advice I give you is that <laughs> when you get a dog, the, the first like year, you're going to take it to the vet like way too much. Yeah, I was about to take it today. Yeah, like any little really? thing, you're like, what's wrong with the dog? And then you realize after time, like, <laughs> dogs will throw up every now and then. Dogs will, you know, do weird shit every night. Like, you don't, it, the vet doesn't. But you got to learn that on your own. Yes. Yeah. Just so, take so it to the just vet. Don't, just don't take it? No, no, take it to the vet. But they, eventually the vet's going to take it. Eventually the vet's going to be like, you don't need to take it in for this. Now that I have this life hack, I'm never going to take it. Yeah. You ever have a dog, KB? Never. Yeah, I never have either. I never had one growing up. Never had one. No, it was not allowed one. One yeah, at she, one. Was this, yeah. a, was this like thought out or was it spur of the moment? No, it was thought out. Yeah. It was thought out for a while. We're trying to find the right one, trying to find the right rescue. Don't want something too big for the city. Want something young enough. Where that we dog's can... going to be decent sized. His parents are, I think, around 20, 19, 20 pounds, so it's not that big. But who knows? I wouldn't mind if it got up to mid-size. 30? Nice mid-size. Oh, it's going to. You think so, Saz? Oh, yeah. Ash wants to, is Ash gonna come over house sit, throw a party, yeah, for the dog. <laughs> Super Bowl week. Yeah, yeah, I might have to. Oh, you shit. dog owner. Yeah, dude, I'm pretty fired up. Walking it, feeding it, and yeah. shit like that. It's a gigantic announcement. It just yeah. Yeah. You think it is? Mm-hmm. I don't think it actually is. Before his birthday. It is. It's a big, dude. It's a fucking big announcement. It's I don't think it's gigantic. I was 45 you minutes You just got your show. first dog. You added a family member. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. exciting for me, mm-hmm. but I don't know if it's a big announcement. Oh, that's a big it's announcement. Huge. It's a big Huge. announcement. Huge. Huge. That's one of your security codes, my friend. That's one of your security questions. Yeah, Pe- Penny123. Yep, right. oh, there it is. Fuck. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Gotcha. I was trying to get. I was. I, I was thinking about doing like a Latina name because it was from uh, down by the border. Ooh, Juanita. Yeah, something like that. I did pitch Juanita. We got close to Paulina, but I. Well, I wanted to say or like Paula. <laughs> yeah, Penny's a good name though. Good. Penny's Everyone told me that they got close to Tortilla. <laughs> Ooh, oh. the Tortilla it's hard, was pitched. It's hard to name girl dogs. <laughs> it was an easy no for me. You think? Yeah. Maya. Girl dogs are to. easier than boy dogs. Oh, no, I disagree. I think girl dogs. Any name that ends with IE, Katie, Sally, Maggie, Molly. They're right, all good. But, but guy dogs, you can literally name any name. You see a guy dog, like you see a bulldog named Kevin, that's cool. That's yeah. cool. That rocks. That is awesome. Yeah. Tom. So he could name, dog named he Paul. Could name the dog Rachel, Rachel or Heather. It'd be, it'd be no, you can't no. have a dog named Rachel. Name it Rachel. Rachel. Name it Rachel. No, no, no. Rachel. Oh, God, no. Sarah? I'm going to get a girl dog named Heather. Imagine naming a dog yeah. Sarah. I bet there's a lot of dogs named Sarah. There's no way. Like there's there's that website you can type in it's like names, most common dog it's names. More, it's if your name is more dog or more human. Yeah. Wise. Have you but seen that? Guy, no, guy, pull, dog, pull guy that names, up. all guy names work. I bet I'm getting nine DMs from people right now that have a dog named Sarah. No yeah, way. But a lot of Sarahs but out If you there. see a dog named Tim, that's funny. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It is. I had a Chester and a Lester one time. Those are, yeah. My dog's names are Lilo and Stitch. Really? Yeah. Real original. We talked about Lilo. It was before the movie came out when you got him. <laughs> yeah. Well, we, they came named. Can't change the name. You can, you can, you can. You can change the name. Yeah. They were already like, I think they were like six months or something. Change. I, change Stella's name was Mama. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> well, we didn't the, the change it. Paws Chicago where uh, I adopted her, they just do, I think it's just like the person who works that day gets to name them all because we went a couple times to look and one, na- one day we showed up and it was like, the dog's names were like Coke, Sprite, Root beer. That's my cat Spork. His name is yeah, Spork. Yeah. And the list was like fork, knife, spork, yeah, right, bowl. right. It was, and I was like, I'll take Spork. So I think we just got. <laughs> she just got. A, you know, was showed up to the to the pound when it was. You know, date like <laughs> dad, mama, yeah, brother. I'm glad we're not drinking mama coffee. Yeah, no. That'd be, that was changed very quickly. I like mama as a name. 
Mama? Like mama has a name? I don't, I don't mind know. it. I think it kind of works. Mama? Mama? Come on, hey, mama. Buy Mama Coffee as well. Hey, Mama. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. The original Works. name of uh, the one that we adopted was uh, it was Sass's address, so I had to change it because I didn't want to dox him mm-hmm. every time I called the dog. Oh, really? Yeah, it was your street name. 98 oh. Waverly Place? <laughs> 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 7th Avenue? Yeah, it was Waverly. <laughs> it was Waverly. That's too long for a pet name. Yeah, that's like a town. Wave. Waverly is not a good name at all. Yeah, that's why dog. we were like, eh, eh. Get out. It's too yeah. much in, brother. This you got a fucking me. dog. Hey, bro, I'm fired Rocks. up about it's it. huge. Are you, like, excited to get home from work today? Big time. It's way more exciting when you have a dog. Yeah, I'm getting the fuck out of here. Hell yes. I'm playing catch with I Spider I Dave wanted you to do an overtime today. <laughs> Dave did? Yeah. No. a double. <laughs> yeah, but uh, what about with your travel schedule? A little worried? I am. Um, my wife will be uh, able to work on it some, and uh, there's pretty good dog daycares in the neighborhood. Sass has volunteered, and... Uh, there's dog walkers, too. Dog walkers and my Brandon wants wouldn't make sense for you, Brandon. You live so far away. My will, brother-in-law has I'll like do a it. dog, a dog's uh, like in Pennsylvania. He has like a dog like training service or something like that. So he we can take it to his. Uh, oh. He's got some acres out there. Those don't work. You don't think? Well, he's making money off it. So yeah, <laughs> you gotta train your dog yourself. And when I say that, you just know that it can sit, and that's about it. Yeah, yeah this dog's you already sitting, bro. Yeah, smart. Oh, enough. that's not good. It's already sitting? <laughs> Too early? Oh. Too soon? You're going to take it to the vet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sure it's not My 12 years old? <laughs> <laughs> My dog's already tired? <laughs> it should not be sitting right now. Fuck. Out of two months. Fuck. Yeah, I can't even take it to daycare until three months. Don't dogs, when I think when they're like puppies like that, they sleep for like 20 hours a day. Yeah, but when they're up, they're up. Yeah. Also, people lie, like puppy lasts till like five. Yeah. In terms of energy. Five years old? Yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. They don't start like, <laughs> mellowing out till about five. Yeah, my dog is seven and he just lays. It's all the yo, laziest dog of life. all time. He just huffs and puffs <laughs> and lays down. Yeah, I know mean, that's how big size. How much? How much pounds does he weigh? Probably like fifty. How much pounds? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Is he fat or super? Or a good oh, fifty? No. Yeah, he had to lose a lot of weight. Are his feet gray? That could be heart disease. No, no. Okay. He's got Grinch feet. <laughs> what? They're green? Yeah. Green. It's awesome. Oh, like, it's like they, 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 he looks like a... Uh, Harry? Yeah. Oh, it's a dog. <laughs> no, if you saw it, you'd know what I mean. Oh, like the point? Yes. I'll show you a picture. <laughs> that dog human name database is paywalled, by the way. So what? Do what? what? Uh, Take my credit card. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know this information. Yeah, this is what my, this is what my dog's feet look like. Ew! What the hell? Oh, yeah. oh they are Grinch feet. Grinch oh. feet. Holy the, oh wow! I love those. <laughs> those are great. <laughs> they look like slippers. I've never seen that. Yeah. yeah that's <laughs> and I want a dog. So I like bad. that. I like yeah. those Grinch. Yeah, I want a wiener dog, real bad. Really? Oh yeah. yeah. I love basketball. Yeah, that's uh, Anthony Rizzo's dog. Is a wiener dog named Kevin. Fucking it's great name. Because you don't think the guy names can just be... I, no, I just think it, it, girl names are easier for dogs. Again, everything with an IE is a girl's dog name. Or A. Anything that ends in an A. Uh. Isn't Frank Leo. the name of the dog in uh, Men in Black? It is. The pug. He's a, he's a pug. Yeah, yeah. Frank's a Funny. good dog name. Yeah. Hot dog Ralph. Too. It's an alien, though. Ralph's a good dog name. Ralph's a great dog name. But Ralph is not a good no. dog Well, name. unless it's a German Shepherd. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah tr- actually, wow. Tr- was, Blond- dog- was Blondie on the table? No. Okay. Is there a Rolf and Muppet Babies? Isn't that, wasn't there? Yeah. A, wasn't there? A, uh, yeah, there is. Cre- wait, not Crenshaw. What was that guy who was in uh, wheelchair? He was like a s- state senator. Or Madison something. Cawthorn or whatever. And he have a dog named Blondie, and he's like, "Oh, I didn't realize. Maybe I made that up." He he is like he went on a vacation wait. to like Nazi places. Oh yeah, big yeah. time. Is that uh, Hitler's dog name? Yeah, Blondie. <laughs> I didn't even yeah. put two and two together. Yeah. Wrong. You're sitting like that again. It's been my shit. Wonder why it's so flexibility for me. Yeah. You want me? You let your dog sleep in the bed? Uh, Question. I'm tr- I mean, last night it did. Uh, it's over. It's over. <laughs> yeah, that's it. it <laughs> done. That's yeah. No, but that's, it didn't want to. It, it like it like popped out. And it's uh, even worse uh, though. You're gonna get used to it. Yeah. Well, I, we just didn't have a crate yet because uh, like we got approved and went up right away. So we have the we ordered the crate. 
I'm trying to get a, I'm trying to make the crate at home. I don't want to use the crate as a punishment. I'm trying to use the crate as uh, <laughs> an oasis. It's going to go from dog. bed to crate, though. Huh? It's going to go from bed to crate. What, do you uh, mean? what about couch? That's better than crate. Couch okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. I mean, I... Who, who, who gives a fuck? I, the whole point of having a dog is to hang out with it. Right. I'm trying to bull with this motherfucker. I get, like, if you have a big dog, maybe you don't want it on the couch, but, like... It's a little on. bitch. I want to fucking... <laughs> that sits right between my legs when I'm watching... Basketball and football every single night. Yeah, bro, on the this couch. dog fucking fell asleep on my fucking ankle facing the door with its back to me, showing that it fucking respected and protected me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What, bro? <laughs> <laughs> I took this dog on a fucking walk through the fucking projects today. It <laughs> met another dog named Spike, which was his first friend, and I started to tear up, dude. I was wow. fucking getting emotional. Dude, imagine seeing a white dude with a pink dog leash walking through the projects with like an eight-pound dog fucking crying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Ian bitch. Spike. I'm a known bitch. Just like my dog. Francis got a second dog. He did, yes. Really? Greedy. Greedy. Very recently. Oh. He's got his place upstate now. Yeah. Mm. And his dog. Yeah. He's just going to Montauk last weekend. Casually. Casual. Driving out to Montauk in his Tesla. That guy's living in 2020. He's got a Tesla? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, big time. He loves that thing more than his dogs. <laughs> yeah. Sleeps in there, watches movies in there. Yeah. Have you guys seen the beer that's been brewed in the window? I did, yeah. I tweeted it. It's, what? It looks like a milkshake. Oh. It, it is. Uh, <laughs> where is oh, it? God. It's in. It's a, by Mook, uh, where, where K. Marco sits. Shit. Oh. It's a gro- Zai, you going to drink it tomorrow? Nah, it's for you guys. One of you guys are drinking. Oh tomorrow. God! We need. Oh, do we need Whoops, to see what tweet. the uh, what the cupcakes are going to say tomorrow? What yeah, the, the power ups are going to be. Oh, we yeah, can yeah, figure yeah. that out tomorrow during this show. There'll be our replace two beers with two Za beers. Oh, oh no! Oh God! That's not beer. That's not no. beer. What it's looks like Za. It's not beer yet. All right, so that should just be one cupcake. We should just have one yeah. death cupcake. Yeah. Nothing else says anything. All right. Except for that one. Yeah, I like that, that is quite the gamble. Yeah, that's a huge gamble. It should we'll be have... a couple minus, I think, minus a beer. Yeah, okay, yeah. That's some positives, like that. yeah. And, and it will be, so what do we need? 16 times three? I think, like, maybe five. Five cupcakes have things in them. We have four of them are good. Four, like, two of them will be like, you don't have to eat this cupcake. Oh, I love that. Okay. Two of them will be minus a beer. Yeah. And then one singular cupcake will be replace two beers with Zah beer. I want I one where that. you have to sit on the cupcake instead of eat it. Ooh. I like that, too. Okay, yeah, that one's good, too. With your asshole open. With your asshole <laughs> gaping. You, are you ready for 16 cupcakes, KB? No, I'm going to eat cupcakes, too. So I, I think I would assume you guys, my teammates, will do at least three? Whatever you want. Three is easy. Three will be light work. Yeah. yeah. Snack on them. We'll snack I'll be on fine. Them. I'll be fine. Uh, are you going to do any side N.A. beers to uh, replace our beer? Like, if you had four N.A. beers throughout the course casually. No. Not even going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> we got you. We got it, Kate. We got yeah. this. Twelve beers. So we got to put. Yeah, this is so fine. TJ, fine. we'll get a big table and we'll just, I'll buy. I can't. Why can't I do the math right now? Cupcakes are ordered already. Oh, oh really? Yep. How many did we get? Uh, too many. 72. <gasps> Ooh. Well, in case you wanted to eat. So, so there's half of them will be vanilla cake and half will be chocolate cake. That way there's no fights over there not being enough of one type if you wanted to. All right, but we should have the exact amount of cupcakes on the table. That, way, only, that, way, we guar- that way we guarantee that the, yeah. the Zabir gets picked. Right. So True. everyone should pick what how many everyone should pick the cupcakes they want to eat beforehand. Like what flavor? What they think. You know what I mean? Yeah. Our sixteen cupcakes, I want I want mine to be vanilla. No, I think I, I think there should want. be a table right here and you gotta go grab your cupcake. Yeah, you go grab it. Yeah. As you go. So then there might be more chocolates than vanillas. You might have to eat more chocolates than vanilla. I'm fine with that. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm with you. I want to eat more vanilla. I oh. like vanilla. Yeah. Like <laughs> vanilla is my answer. Yes. It's when you get to it. Does, anyone, does anybody like chocolate? I like chocolate. I like chocolate, but I can see it being easier with beer to have vanilla. Yeah. But I'll do what I got to do. Well, the vanillas will go first. Yeah. Oh, I feel nervous for this. I don't think that that, that part is going to matter at all. It's not like when you're on your seventh cupcake, you're going to be like, I wish this was vanilla, dude. Yeah, you're not thinking. You're not tasting flavor. <laughs> yeah. You're going to be like, I, I can't eat this, is what you're going to be. Very excited. And TJ's got uh, themes coming for our birthdays. Oh. Yeah, I showed Brandon part of Big Cat's theme, and he just wasn't impressed at all. <laughs> I was Brandon. pissed off about it. What did you show me? 
earlier today before the pick central. My theme is 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 wrestling. Oh yeah, no, 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 no! I didn't know that's what you were showing me. You didn't say that was part of Big Cat's theme. I liked it. I liked it a lot. What's yours, KB? I thought we had to pick ones that you could like buy at a birthday store. That's what TJ did. Okay, I did Black Panther because there's only like four <laughs> options. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that's like they do like it's like Superman, Minions, and Black Panther. What did you do, TJ? Make it easy. <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> Love it. So Fortnite wrestling Black Panther theme. Wait, Ken that's Jay our theme for NFL. what? The birthday. It's we're doing it for the birthday. So, so Kyle, is your face paint yeah. going to have to match your theme? I mean, that's what I was worried about. <laughs> Wait, do we have a face uh, painter? Wait a minute. Yeah, we have a face painter. Right. So what are we getting face painted as our squad? Yeah, we got to talk to Che. Because Black Panther, even the masks are black. Right. So even if we get the Black Panther masks and intentionally I would wear a mask, an actual mask. There's little uh, really cheap masks. No, I think y'all need uh, to paint Black Panther faces on yourself. I don't think so. I feel like that's... Bad. No, you could do it if it's like. Yeah, you could like. No, I can be. No, bucky. you could do it if like half the face is showing. Like, like the same style as like Batman. Yeah. I don't think yeah. You can. People do Batman all the time. Definitely. Batman's can. not. Trade themes. Though. Trade themes with us then. <laughs> I guess Black Panther is uh, different. That could than be Batman. Every, every team doesn't have a theme because our 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 team doesn't have a birthday football. guy. Football. Football. Our team does not. Oh, it is. football. Yep. He gets wrestling. I got football. It's not your birthday, Brandon. Mm. Pick up those papers. Yeah, pick up those papers, yeah. bitch. Where are these it's birthday from? case race. That's what we're doing it for. The next one will be in Sass's birthday. No, because last year we did it in April, and it was only Sass's birthday, and my birthday was right behind him. Y'all never mentioned my birthday. So next year will be, or so April will be you and Sass. My birthday's also in April. Wow. wow. Three oh, of you. Remember? And I'd like to, wrestling to be my theme and no one else's. Okay, nice. Fire in June, Tips. Right? Yes. Are we all, yeah. we're all April? We're, yeah, April 5th, April 13th, April 25th. Damn, that's Me very and Nick impressive are that you know that. Love it. Yeah. All clumps, big clumps. I don't, yeah, see? I, no, I don't think I can do that. I don't like the silver lines in it. <laughs> well, uh, here we go. Yeah, that's totally do that. fine. There's nothing no, wrong with that. Gotta make sure that <laughs> no, I don't think oh, you just got to make sure the ears are pronounced. can yeah, do no, that. That's think. nothing wrong with that. I don't. <laughs> that's, uh, so what, what are we going to get face painted as? Baseballs? <laughs> Wait, it does. Our face paint doesn't have to match the theme, does it? Oh no. Okay. Okay. But it has to be a united face paint. Kind I of think thing? the three of us should have the same face paint. I, I might don't just know. We don't have to, but I think that'd yeah. be dope. Yeah, I think that'd be cool. I might do my own face paint. What? Like I might not be with my team. I might just do my own face paint. No. What are we gonna do? I don't know. Aisha's? My team's not here. My team's only sixty-five percent today. I don't even know if Chase's gonna show up tomorrow. Who's the artist? Same one. Okay. Oh, yeah. She couldn't. She couldn't Gautier me last time. No, I tried to do Patrick the first time from SpongeBob, and she was like, well, "I can't do Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty easy. Just pink. <laughs> Having a beard is the worst for being face painted. Yeah, oh, yeah. half the canvas. Huh. Uh, I'm not. I don't want to do the Joker at all. So I'm not. Good boy. You should do the Timberwolf. I'm not gonna do that from your hat. I know. Why not? Because I'm not a Timberwolves fan. You wear the hat every day. I, don't, I have two hats. This is one of them. I might do a Pokeball. My whole face. Yeah? yeah. yeah a Pokeball? Nice. I might do gold Poke dust. <laughs> okay, cool. Pokeball. <laughs> gold dust <laughs> would be cool. Yeah, yeah. Just, just raw fish <laughs> on my face. really cool. Is that a wrestler? Yeah. Okay. I think we should all do Black Panther. Should we be Blue Man Group? We could do Blue Man Group. Oh. <laughs> we could do Blue Man Group. That would be hilarious, hiring someone to come in to just paint us all blue. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, that's no, well, that's not even face paint. That's he's not being a that's forehead. Paint. I feel like it'd be cool to make the eyeball the pokeball. We got to figure out something reunited. I th I, I yeah. think we got to do something together. What are you thinking, KB? Three Stooges. Trying to think. Yeah, um, they're just out there. Get that <laughs> I feel like Shane's football helmet was the funniest last yes. time. Uh, TJ, can you just pull up like famous trios? Mm. See what we can do. Yakko, Wacko, and Dot. Snap, Crackle, and Pop. Mm. Manny, Mo, and Jack. <laughs> Peanut butter. And Kelly, <laughs> <laughs> just an ampersand, ampersand face. <laughs> what, what do you think the best food trio is in the world? Of three things. Three things. Mm. Maybe well, like I, think, uh, oh, my, my, I know my 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 mind. Come on. Is it enchiladas yeah, with his chocolate? Egg, it's chocolate pizza? peanut butter. Pretzels. Oh, SpongeBob. Uh, BLT. Oh, the chipmunks. No. We could be the chipmunks. Should we that be would SpongeBob? Be steak, Brussels sprouts. Maybe SpongeBob. Three SpongeBobs. No, there's Patrick Star and whatever the other guy is. Squidward. Squidward. Might be eggs, cheese, and hash browns. Mm. You saying no. best or like? Smoke. It's chocolate peanut butter pretzel. I think that's the best three-way combo. What about chocolate peanut butter ice cream? 
Yeah, dude, no. I think he just beat you. No. How did I not beat you? Pretzel, You'd rather have pretzel than ice chocolate cream? Chocolate and pretzel and peanut butter? Chocolate Three different and foods. peanut like... butter and ice cream. No. Who has to be chocolate? No. <laughs> How would you... If I put those in front of you, you'd take the pretzels over the ice cream? I think the chocolate and the pretzel are the best... I think that's the best duo in food. That's crazy. The, well, you could just tell that you're, you're, I, 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 you're I a skinny eat, bitch. Oh, like you're, yeah. I don't like straight chocolate and I don't like straight pretzels. But when you put them together, it's like a 9.7. But that's a healthy guy snack. No, that's a healthy guy snack. Yes, it is. Chocolate yeah, pretzels? You only eat, yes, like, they are, dude. Yeah, it's you a healthy eat, guy like, snack. Of them. No, it is. You get it, it from Whole Foods. It's probably one of the fattest snacks. No, it's not. Chocolate pretzels? Anyone who's getting chocolate pretzels, that's like their treat for the month. Yeah, right. They're like, oh. It's a healthy guy snack. I had a cheat day yesterday. I had a handful of chocolate pretzels. Chocolate pretzels are the best tasting dessert. No they're, they're, I think they're good, but I don't think that they're like. That's not a dessert. It's no. like a. That's like your mom throws it in a baggie and puts right, it in your lunch. Right. If you think that's a dessert, you're a health nut. No. Yes. You love your physique, no. which is good. You love your body. You respect yourself. I Ice cream is a dessert. Chocolate pretzels? That's not a dessert. What? Not even what? close. Not a dessert. No. What is? I it? would argue that chocolate strawberries are more of a dessert. Yes. Than chocolate All right. Pretzels. So, like, um, is a Reese's cup a dessert? Yes. Yeah. And a chocolate pretzel. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a snack, not a dessert. Right. That's a dessert snack. What about baklava, ice cream, and honey? No. <laughs> <laughs> I fuck with that heavily. It's a meal. Baklava. Delicious. It's 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 okay. You don't like baklava? I said it's okay. You don't love baklava? We gotta go to Mahmoud's and get some baklava. What was that goddamn yes. thing you brought me that time? That was Lou Jamoon. Yeah. Lou Jamoon. Yeah. I never could remember. Is that what that was? Fuck that was yeah, good. That Jamun. wet or that wet bread that Honey? Keith brought us. Donut. Uh, I'll yeah. never forgive her for that. Ugh. Wet bread? It was so wet. It was the wettest. Can we get balupas tomorrow that? for the case race? <gasps> We're already having a cupcake. Well, just as a well, side fucking what? dish. Well, I think we're going to get part of my cheesesteak delivered after the race. Oh, that's oh. a robot coming? Maybe. Oh, no. What if? You're going to have to tip the robot $1,000. Oh, I crested it. It was Oh, yeah. Who, we have to order something to tip. I think we might have to put that one to rest. Why? I was scared. Yeah, so people, awkward last people, time. People, I, I, I had a hard time watching it. I, I blame the guy who got it. thousands of dollars and wasn't appreciative. <laughs> He didn't know what was going on. Huh? He didn't know what was going on. I knew what was going on. He, he didn't speak English. He walked into an office at like 11 p.m. to Around cameras and we're throwing cash. grown men dressed up in costumes. No, that's on him, dude. Have some joy in your life and fucking uh, enjoy the moment one time. Like, he really didn't want it. Didn't he try and give it back? That's what I mean, bro. Just like this guy was awesome. Caught up in the moment. It was Look, also happening at. while Che was trying to fight Shane, I believe. I think, yeah. Yeah. That's why it was bad. I think the last case race, just things moved too fast. We tried to relive too many good memories from the first one. So we need to take our time this we time. got to take our time. That's the point of the cupcakes. Yeah. yeah. Slow us down. Speed bumps. Yeah. I think Traffic that uh, circles. Che and Gillis ordering Chinese food together could be a uh, good icebreaker. Oh, yeah. Che and we'll Gillis. Finally, finally find out his order. Whoa. Che and Gillis. <laughs> Shane Che. Hey, Shane. Should we spin this wheel? Are you doing the pro football show with me today? Yes. Okay, nice. Three thirty, right? Yeah. DJ said I have to do it the rest of the year. That's, That's not true. You're good wrong. at it. It's it's today. I Just today. want to do it the rest of the year. Mm. Yeah, I did. You're good on the show. You have stupid takes. Like Dak Prescott's next up. You don't know ball at <laughs> all. <laughs> That's not what I said. Ass does though. Ass yeah, ball. On that. Yep. I make the best airplanes, bro. Make good airplanes. My one talent. Spin that wheel, TJ. Pitch this, bro. Have a little fun. Right where you Love wanted it, it to go. Oh, bro, you ripped that sandbag. <laughs> <laughs> Can we, I, would, I want balupas. I want balupas. Why? I want them. I'm craving them. I can't. I can't find them anywhere. You're sounding like Veruca Salt right now, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I want. I want. I want. <gasps> I'm sorry. A bad egg. I just know what I want. I can't believe you were about to say cheese, eggs, and hash browns. Why not meat with that combination? Bacon's oh. got to be in there. Yeah, I bacon think. instead of cheese. Bacon and I eggs. think cheese, eggs, yeah, and hash cheese. browns are better than any th other three breakfast foods you can put together. What? Bacon, eggs, and hash browns. It's perfect. Better. Cheese, eggs, hash browns. You put the cheese in the eggs? What would you substitute the bacon for? Cheese. You need the cheese. How about how about <laughs> pancake sausage syrup? So there's that. <laughs> pancake sausage. So no. 
Yes. Yeah, Sir, that syrup's so not good. a food. Like, like pig, pigs in a blanket. Like a sausage so like rolled good. up in a pancake? Yeah, you yeah get pigs in a blanket. That's a thing. No. You get the sausage and you get pancakes with a side of sausage and you just fucking yeah. douse the whole thing in syrup. But again, syrup's not a food. Syrup's so. yeah, it so. Well, it's supposed to make and one one food. If peanut oh, yeah. butter, I like to take the pancake. Oh, a chocolate sausage, peanut, yeah. uh, cheese chocolate eggs peanut butter covered pretzel. It's gross. So it's the chocolate peanut butter pretzel is number one. We know that. <laughs> what's, what, what's next up? I think what's, that it's honey, ice cream, and baklava. Oh. Bacon, egg, and cheese. <laughs> I, I can make a bacon. cheese for the good. Think bacon. That's on that, that, you, need, you need a sandwich for yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. Right. Well, it's not that. I think, yeah. Bacon, egg. But if you could only do three things, hash it's all right, so eggs, I hit the bacon, nail. and oh, hash browns. Yeah. Eggs, okay. cheese, cheese got to go. You need cheese. You got to get cheese you need out. Cheese. No, get you need the bacon. Get rid of how about, how about no. what about steak, butter, and potatoes? Oh. I said, yeah, I did. I wouldn't count The original one was steak, Brussels sprouts, and potatoes. Then those are two separate things. Oh. What about hamburger, French fry, ketchup? The, the potatoes are separate. I just keep from trying the to throw condiments in there. All right, so I hit the nail on the head with dessert and breakfast. You guys want to try with lunch and dinner? <laughs> you did it, bro. Baklava and fucking. Did we come to the conclusion that syrup's not a. Uh, not why? A why is it not a food? Because it's not a food. It goes on food. Oh, what about peanut butter? Oh, peanut butter goes. You never on food. eat syrup by yeah. itself. Peanut you butter can. can be no. Peanut butter can be its own food. You, you ever take a shot of syrup? No. No. I've, yeah, you don't take a shot of syrup. So honey doesn't count either, then. So I can add something else to the baklava and the ice cream. Maybe we should yes, have a syrup could. case race. Good God, I think you die. <laughs> yeah. I don't think that's did a deal uh, breaker. Yeah, super did troopers. Super troopers. Oh, didn't the, die. The, the, oh, yeah. Throwing up from that. Yep. Be slow as hell. It'd be like slow, yeah, slow throw up. <laughs> oh, that'd be I want to puke tomorrow. <laughs> Why is puking uh, all of a sudden a prerequisite? Big it's funny. bubble. It's or our tummies are going to be so full. You know, if you puke, you are done. You keep drinking. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you could no, go. You can't keep drinking. You keep eating. You can't cupcake. You can't go keep cupcake. Drinking. You keep eating, though. I. It's the pacing that's going to be key. Don't worry about the. I'm going to try to get 16 cupcakes. Okay. And if anything, you want to eat the cupcakes after you. We want to drink the beer. Gonna We're going to yeah. drink that. We're going to mix and match. I thought we were going to go all beers first. I think we'd be beer, fine cupcake, like slowly beer, eating cupcake. a cupcake as we go. Romania. But not yeah. right. It's not That's even exactly really about the actual race as much as it's about having the least amount of comments about you after the race. Right. That's true. That's what your goal should be. That's what Martin Luther King said. Goal should be to come out with just maybe five comments like, hey, right. was Sass even there? Is <laughs> he on the race today? That's how you know that That's you, how you, know you did well. There's a lot of pressure on you, Sass. And yes. the good thing is... You're not saying this out loud to the chat right now, so they're not going to troll right. you by commenting. I let them. Only know. I let them know. Yeah, I know my plan. And if Dope. they want to comment about me, fine. <laughs> they're probably right. If you just I'm totally fine with and me. All the comments are like, "Sass didn't even participate. What if he's too good for this show?" And I would say, "Maybe you're right. <laughs> <laughs> You've changed, man." Yeah. I don't have Shane's number. I had to DM him like a hobo. And he hasn't gotten back to me about our face paint, so I don't know what we're going to face paint. So what, you DM'd him one minute ago? Oh, like ten minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> like you, you made it seem like you DM'd him like a week ago. You have a date. <laughs> back in the call, so. I feel like you have, a, you have a day to answer a DM. You have an hour to answer a text. Right? Do you that's think he's looking forward to it, or do you think he's like, oh, God, I forgot I told these guys I'm going to do this thing? That's definitely A little bit of both. Is. Yeah. Well, now Che is asking me for his number. <laughs> Oh, no. Everyone I'm going to wait for him to ask someone else. <laughs> Everybody message him right now. So what should we get our faces painted as, KB? You're our team captain. Um, Thinking outside the box real quick, what about using our mouths as, hold on, you. wait for it. I don't know if you could see this, but like m your eye is the monkey's eye and your, hold on, and then your mouth is like the butthole of the. That's pretty that's, cool. Oh, that's good. Like we gotta think outside. A little gross, the box, though. Maybe. A little <laughs> gross. A little <laughs> gross. <laughs> gross me out a little. Bit. Uh, red bulbous ass. Yeah. <laughs> it's the clubhouse. We, have like a, we don't have a better idea right no, now. No I've always idea. wanted like a, a realistic scar. <laughs> 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 oh, I like that. Like scar face or scar from no, the like, Lion King. Just like or? a uh, just something light, like on the cheek, like the, over <laughs> the eye. It's one. the coolest just thing in leprosy. the world. Yeah, we could do. Le Let's all take a disease. Last one scar. Yeah. When we did disease, yeah, not like seal, like yeah. a cool, like, like a cool one. Uh, you want like a you got hit by an axe, or like a bite, like a COVID. shark bite. Oh yeah. Okay. No, but you need it you're in right. the right place. If it's in the wrong place, you're fucked. Truth. A lot of truth oh. there. CP. You need a hot scar. Didn't Big Evan somebody do that once? They 
I swear, I have this memory when I first started I think Barstool. It was they him were and Mantis, yeah. Yeah, the Mantis did full ICP, and didn't they really? go? They went to they like a Juggalos? New York Juggalo the- style show, and nobody else was in Facebook. <laughs> oh, that's right. That. Really? <laughs> yeah. Gab doesn't get enough credit for yeah. getting a job because someone trolled him and told me he had a job interview. Yeah. <laughs> so did he show up to the office or something? Yeah, he showed yeah. up to the office. Yep. He's like, I'm here for my interview. And Dave was like, what are you talking about? Remember when that dude made the fake account with my name and texted Frank that he was on the show? <laughs> yeah. We also had the dude who made so a fake funny. account and DM Lenny Dykstra and he showed up with a gun to the office. That was my what? First, that was my first time in the office. Yeah. And it's Lenny like Dave told me to come here and then we yeah. looked at his we we're like, show us and this the guy, shit's a little too much for me. The guy he was DMing <laughs> with had seven followers. Yeah. That's fucking crazy. <laughs> Oof. Some people just don't have the, you know. Yeah. That. Yeah, they all, you know? Just all there. Huh. Thing. That thing, that thing. That thing. Mm-hmm. Somebody made a Yak Monopoly board. What? Oh. Someone just fart. There was a fart. I heard. <laughs> there was somebody just farted. Is that you, baby? baby? No. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it was. Somebody <laughs> just wait, 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 we need to rewind. That was a huge yeah, fart. That was a We need to look fart. at the cameras. It sounded like a worried fart. You guys all heard a <laughs> fart? It sounded a worried fart. enormous sound. fart. Okay. It was. It sounded like, oh. It was like, yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, let's <laughs> see. I didn't hear it. I didn't really? hear it. Really? I don't know if I can heard you, it. Can you, like, scrape your hand along okay, this? Yeah, let's Make see. Something. Do we have everybody's camera angle? That thing. Somebody made a Yak Monopoly board. What? Oh. Someone just fart. Was was before a, I said no. Can't hear it. You can't. Be, you made can't a yak monopoly hear. board. What? Oh. Yeah, you can hear it. Was it that like a trombone. See my face turn. Mm. Somebody made a yak monopoly board. What? Oh, oh it's really quiet. Oh. Just, it's like a low trumpet yeah. sound. Yeah. But in reality, though, it sounded louder. Yeah. Yeah. Because it was off mic by your asshole. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what happens when the show turns into a fart show. You come with one in the chamber. You gotta let it off. Right. Hard to hold it in. That's why I'm excited about having a dog, bro. I'm blaming. Mm-hmm. Oh, dude, dogs fart and they smell so bad. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> smells worse than a dog fart. Oh, bro, you're gonna want to give Penny back. Wait, when are we stinky clouding? We still have mm. to do that. <laughs> I have I bought? We'll probably do that when we do the 12 hour yak. Yeah. Which we're doing for the 500 show. <laughs> no, we are doing it. Yeah. 500 show. Whenever that lands. What show is it now? Oh, we're <laughs> not that far like away. 40 left. Yeah. And this is of YouTube shows. Oh. So 500 YouTube shows, not even Total Yaks. Connor, I think, was maybe trying to archive Total Yaks. We're coming but up on 1,000 on Total Yaks, right? When the library of Alexandria burned down, we lost a lot of that. That'd be way right. more than that if we've done 500 YouTube. Yeah. It is more. I don't know. It happened for years before we put it on YouTube. I don't know. What's the Yak Monopoly board? <laughs> Want to play? It's going to take us six hours. Yeah. Yakopoly. Okay. Oh, Big Cat's Pop. Oh, this is clever. This is good. Okay, Expect yeah. number seven, Av. All right. New Jersey Fastest Transit. This is Rat Infested Apartment. Oriental <laughs> Avenue <laughs> for, <laughs> for Che. <laughs> Speed Demon, Mississippi Avenue. <laughs> All right. What do we got up here? Oh, nice. Wow. Portland was a person avenue. <laughs> Marie Hachimura Place. Bad Milk Avenue. New Jersey <laughs> Transit. Oh, man. Dope Braces Avenue. Lomo Saltado Place. Did a case race with Nick the Juice the Avenue. High Noon. That's brand aware. Oh, Big Cat's Ho- Pile. Yeah, Hogs Hogs for avenue. Cause Avenue. I'm the Joker Baby Boulevard. Steve Clit Avenue. The Baby Boy Boulevard. Will Compton's Little Dick Place. <laughs> Kibby's <laughs> Wild. I'll tip you. Righteous <laughs> King of the South <laughs> Avenue. This is great. Uh, Freedom Avenue. Day to Day. Big Cat's Pile. The Oregon Trail. New Jersey Trail. Chase Flooded House. <laughs> Tank Thursday Avenue. Yak Basketball. Tommy, Tommy Walker, Walker Day. Yeah. That's we should good. play this. Yeah, that's all. <laughs> Why did Tommy Walker Day allow you to take all of Brandon's money? <laughs> is that what it said? Yeah. It's <laughs> great. It's really good. Well Ooh, is there a video, KB, of you of you saying I'll tip you righteous? Oh yeah. 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 Like an oil <laughs> baron. I gotta hear. I gotta watch that. Wasn't it? It was at uh It was the at the store. bar where Jenks yeah. took a knee for me. I'll tip you righteous. It was at the hotel <laughs> bar. You were so tan. You he, were was like, oil he was leaning so far back in his chair. That was so <laughs> funny. Was it for a show or you just said? Oh, he was just drinking. He, <laughs> he had to black out. Oh, he had to black out, yeah. to black yeah. out right, for that yeah. episode. And he got to the bar and was just drinking Moscow mules, right? Oh. Yeah, no, I um 
<laughs> I was already like a, d- a bottle deep <laughs> of Pink Whitney, which is just. Which is so good. (laughs) We had the complimentary one in the room. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and then I had to go like ask Owen if I could use his. Yeah. If I could borrow his. (laughs) God damn. (laughs) What did Owen say? He let yeah, I drank that all too. I I think I blacked out for every show. Yeah. And you were hilarious. But what did you say about the woman that worked at the tanning bed? I you were like, I think I, I think, think like I love her, and I was like, was well, she hot? And you were like, no, but she's obtainable. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta, re- I gotta get back on that shit. <laughs> so How can you get there without like drinking? You know what I mean? Like, what do you mean? There should be a way to get blacked out without all. There's the nothing ab- that compares to alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. It's the whole. Not, it, it, not it, even it, chocolate it, pretzels. It, it is. It is number one. Can we ditch the cupcakes. Just nothing go traditional case. Chocolate race. Nothing. pretzels. The best. <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> Barley <laughs> water and, and rice. The best three combinations. I want a beer now. All of a sudden. Yeah, that sounds good. Cool. Yeah, right. <laughs> I almost relapsed on a martini liche. Really? I, thought, I was like, I can eat this, and then I, I didn't. That was a liche. The, the lychee, lychee, lychee. <laughs> yeah, lychee. Like, I hate that flavor. Yeah, I think it's bad too. Yeah. What flavor? L- the lychee. That's I never ordered one because I never knew how to say it. What, yeah, what I don't order it? shit I don't know yeah. how to say. I just avoid it. Oh, really? Acai, Acai bowls or whatever. They just pick up the menu Acai. and just point to it and say all of that. Yep. Yeah. Then they know. Yeah. Then they know you're dumb. Yeah. Let's probably try and mumble it, and they'll be like, "What?" And right. I have to shout the thing I don't know how to say. Yeah. The acai bowl, acai, acai. No, we all got to be more like Brandon and just order. Order what? Angry. You definitely order things you don't know how to say. How would you have gotten Lomo Saltado the first time? I knew how to say it. That's a very easy word to say. Nah. You need to get more. Get your uh, wife to order it for you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We need to get find out what every culture's version of Lomo Saltado is because I want to try their like comfort food mm-hmm. steak, French fry, rice dish. Their heaviest thing. Yeah, Lomo Saltado is heavy. Like it's just. God, I love it. God, I fucking love that shit. DJ, what uh, what headphones do you use for gaming? Since you're talking shit on my headphones. Astro A forty two R's. Astros. Yeah. Yeah. Turtle Beaches were good in like 2011, 2012. Oh! I have the gu- I have the new ones, the Stealth Five Hundreds or whatever. They're wireless. You just got wireless is always so worse than hard. Wired. What? Wireless, wireless is, is always worse. worse than wired. Oh man, you got owned. No, I was gonna get Astros. They were actually the same price. Huh? And I, and I said, you know what? I, I know I knew I know Astros are good, but I, I just wanted to go with my reliable. Also, Turtle Beaches come with a sticker. Who doesn't want a free sticker? I love stickers. Good point. Yeah, true. true. Should have said that. You should have led with that. Also, not yeah. really a free sticker. You are paying for the whole thing. Mm. Probably baked into the price. It's a free sticker. It says free sticker on the box. They wouldn't lie. It would. Turtle Beach. It's a very honest brand. Why was he talking shit about your Turtle Beaches in the comments on Son of a Boy Dad? <laughs> no way. <laughs> no way. I love getting in the comments. <laughs> Yeah, should we get the, the Grant Cardone comments? People should definitely subscribe. Oh, yeah, let's check in one second. I got to go in a minute, but let's check in. How's it going? Followers, believe it or not, because they see your own Power stance. something. If it you say something cool stance. in addition to it, super cool. Right? I do a Twitter space almost every night. It's in a live audio space every night. And you guys can come in those rooms with me, start collaborating with me, and I'll start getting you more followers. I'll start bringing you into the rooms and introducing <laughs> you to people. What? It's called collaboration marketing. I'm going to be doing it with Russell today. Okay, I'm going to go on Twitter. Let me post it up there real quick. Oh, wait, is he going live right uh, now? Giving away $10,000 <laughs> today. Period. 10X, hashtag 10X giveaway. It's hilarious that people do this dead seriously when it's like our, our uh, joke. One thing, one, one more thing. Yeah. Like I forget that Grant Cardone.com forward slash 2023. Wait, he has a Twitter space going right now? Yeah, I'm joining it. Okay, <laughs> now I got a link. Now I'm going to hit send. When you guys see it, all you got to do is hit retweet. You got to hit retweet or you could hit. Um, he doesn't even know how to use Twitter. Quote tweet. Same Quote thing. the tweet, which means you could add something special. See if we can get on. So we got to get on. How to add something requested. special right here? It's already up. It's already out. Four hundred million people have the potential to see that dumb tweet right there. Oh. I put a hashtag. I didn't do the hashtag right. I think I can still edit it. Can I? Oh boy. Oh God. 
Let me see. See, see, see. This see, the speed, speed, and this is what I'm trying to sh the tell you right now. Yeah, I can edit it. Damon. Okay. The speed the is more important than the correctness. You see the comments saying, definitely have to sign up for Twitter You guys do ASAP. what I'm telling you to do right now. I'm telling you, not only will you build a bigger business, you will also break the back of procrastination okay, tip this guy like an oil baron. Hmm. This disease you have to please everyone. The speed at which you can do something. I'm going to requote it. I'm going to retweet it. I'm not going to overthink it. Okay? You could even misspell it. Try that. Misspell something in the oh quote. Oh, my God. I can't spell. I'm a redneck. Oh. Oh. Redneck. oh it doesn't that's matter what you actually chose. What you. you're doing is building on something. Damn, he went after you. Now, if you didn't post it right now, I'm telling you guys, I'm a power terminal on the Internet. You got to find power terminals on the internet Whoa. and support them. A power terminal. You want to flow power to other power terminals. <laughs> when I see people do that for now me, with me, me I yeah, want to flow man, the I'm power like back word. to them. This goes back to what? The other thing. Yeah. Who knows you? Do you guys want to start at the bottom or do you want to start at the top? top. Yeah, obviously top. I don't know. What's he Who write? knows you? Who? Who's talking to you? That was a good line. Who's working yeah. with you? Who's buying from you? Who's supporting you? Who's uh, edifying you? He who's still has who's yet giving to you say receipts? Anything of substance. And then number five. That was fun. Damn. Oh, that shit is Grant dope. Cardone. Man, I love this shit. Power man. terminal. I like that. I want to get a power, a power terminal, terminal painted on my face tomorrow. That'd be nice. Not a bad idea. Hmm. So we'll what, what are what are we gonna? So we get we're getting scars. Realistic scars. As a team. Mm -hmm. Wounds. That. I'd be so pissed if she can't do that. I mean, considering she's like a a, a children's party makeup artist, I'd, I'd believe she could. Realistic. Yeah. No. Movie quality. I want movie quality scars. I want to walk in and I want people to be horrified. My when I when I was when I used to play hockey in like second grade. Um, for Halloween, we all, we all, our coach put like fake blood all over all of our faces and like our necks and stuff. And they like, they like stopped the game, like the ref did to like make sure we were all okay. Yeah. I mean, that would make Shoot. sense. Yeah. That'll, that'll, that'll do it. Yeah. That'll do it. Yes, ref. It was funny. Ref didn't even get it. Damn. It's a prank, bro. It's a prank. <laughs> all right. Yeah. All right. <laughs> all right. All righty. Should we see everyone tomorrow? Yeah. Sure. Uh, the tungsten people reached out, so we could have them call in at some point. Yeah, if you guys want to talk some tungsten. So they called uh, Austin Jenkins yesterday, and uh, he put the tungsten people on speakerphone, and we were trying to have some banter with them, and the guy on the phone said, uh, just a heads up, tungsten people don't really have a sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. All right, we'll call him tomorrow. So we'll see everyone tomorrow. We'll do a one-hour show, and then case race on Friday. Like the video. Thank you, everyone, for watching. 10X. 10X if you're with me. Power Terminals. Happy birthday, Santiago. Happy birthday, Santi!